It started with some complaints we received from citizens in the area. I had just moved here and in the first week, somebody drove up our driveway, was talking to my neighbor, and came out and started telling us about this quarry. It can be so disturbing that it can waken me from my sleep through my closed windows, and it sounds like it's war-torn Kosovo with munitions going off. I don't think the quarry's gonna go away. It's here. It shouldn't be here, but it's here. The end point is not they're gone. The end point is they're gonna to have to operate differently. There's people that rely on the industry that may not even realize it. There's people that would rather not have a quarry in our county that don't realize how vital that is to the growth and economy of our county. It's a rare find. Everybody is lucky that it's there. I think it's very viable to protect it. A lot of the challenges that are currently being laid on the table from the residents are concerns about contamination of water and air. I would like to see the whole mine shut down. There are other options out there. A best case outcome is where the residents and the industry can work and live in concert and look for a meaningful solution that can last forever. The construction industry is made up of families and kids and generations of people that rely on what we do every day. If nobody's looking out to protect a resource in 20 years, then we're gonna have to look for more drastic options.